Uh, I'm here with uh, Clayton Wow. My name is uh, Moses Rodin uh, Michael from uh, UI uh, Media. I would like to ask Clayton more about uh, the process of getting the final product of uh, Ugele string band, which was taken in the western part of the sermon. So, uh, I want to ask you, Clayton, uh, some of your brief background about yourself. My name is Clayton, and um, I've been involved in starting to do recording grade 8, and it's been like 10 or 11 years for me involving in recording but for the time it was just like recording and making music from the computers and stuff but for string band it's a uh, totally new thing I would uh, just like to ask uh, when you make that music what uh, um, challenges you face during the process of getting that music how, how do you do it? First of all as I said recording uh, string band is a new thing for me and that's the first time that I've recorded uh, string band I have to look for a way which I'm going to record the, the guitars and the bamboos and the vocals in a way that it is uh, dynamic and clear. And so looking at the guitars, the guitars are uh, not like new as we've expected and it's very old. We also have the bamboos which are uh, old and they are like made some years back and uh, so making it you know, getting the mics to it and trying to get the right and quality sound, it's its a new thing for me. I have to use my ears carefully to get the right sound. Maybe I'll start with the bump first and then I'll go with the guitar and when I get the uh, whole structure of that music and then I'll, I'll record the best vocalist and I'll try and combine everything and do the mixing and mastering and later do the shooting and the shooting was done by a, a very young boy, his name is Panapaza. He's the one that officiated the whole program of those uh, recording things. Hello, uh, this is my first recording of string band from the western province. So here we have the bamboo. The recording is a bit tiring. Yeah, listen up.